It could be described as the ultimate in bling. This fine gold necklace with its turtle pendants was handmade more than 2,000 years ago. It was unearthed during excavations from a burial site in the Caucasus. Colchis, in what is now the western half of Georgia, is believed to be the mythical land Jason and the Argonauts sailed to in their quest for the Golden Fleece. The necklace is among 140 artefacts being shown at the Fitzwilliam Museum in Cambridge, the only UK stop for this exhibition. And the richness of the burials of these people who must have been the elite at this particular area in Georgia, they are full of golden objects and the quality of the workmanship is very particularly good and the use of te techniques such as filigree and uh, granulation where it used granulation is, is created by using tiny drops of molten gold onto a base piece um, to get a, a, an interesting design. Colchis sat on one of the main trade routes between East and West. It was described as rich in gold, but it was also important for wine production. These heads depict companions of Dionysus, the Greek god of wine. All the exhibits have been loaned by the Georgian National Museum. It's important for Georgian cultural heritage to be presented out of country, but also to show to the world that Georgia is country of the Golden Fleece. Georgia is a country of all civilization. We always were part of European civilization, and we want to be part of Europe too. The exhibition continues until January the 4th and is free. It gives us a rare insight into a forgotten but clearly highly cultured civilization. Paul Seagrove, BBC Look East, Cambridge.